Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Fredbear and Friends Left to Rot. We are not done yet. I want to try and do the custom uh, the custom rooms, sorry. Um, Pixel told me that it's a little bit different from the main game and there's new mechanics and stuff, so let's try it. Um, I'm gonna start off by doing these ones, like all the challenges, and then I'm gonna go further up. So the first one, I mean there's nothing here and there's literally nothing. So I'm guessing this mode is like for seeing where the cameras are and everything. So I guess let's start with the second one. We have two animatronics, prototype and suit. So prototype if I remember was one on cam 3 on the first night and then suit was the one that you need to bring on the upper levels. But it might be different because it's in a different area and they're all together as well, they're not all in different rooms. A prototype will come down the left hallway. All right, shine your flashlight on, on him until he leaves. Seems pretty simple. I don't know if he has a sound cue or something. That's something we have to discover. Your suit, your suit, will appear on either camera at the third television. Click advance to send him back. Okay, so either camera of the third television. I don't know what it means by third television. I guess I'll figure that out. And uh, yeah, I need to click advance to send him back. So oh yes, left hallway, camera, and then we should be done. This is set on level 10. And this is like on level 15, so near quite difficult, but it shouldn't be that bad. Uh, the investigators are on their way to, you, uh, way to your office. Prepare for your, for your escape by cutting radio transmission and securing building doors. Be patient and look out for out oncoming animatronics. Don't know why I cannot read today. Uh, televisions 1, 2, 3 and 4. Okay, so I need to check out either uh, f the free television either side i don't know what it means by either side though so my objective is to cut radio transmissions and secure building doors okay how do i do that let's play it and see what it's about yeah every time the game loads my webcam freezes but it's fine so three this is the third one okay and that's what it means by either all right so check these two and then check the left door and if it's here Oh, hello there. I mean, they're not activated this night, so I should be fine. Um, did I just hear something? Nope. Okay. So, transmission. I need to hold it down. Can I... Okay, I need to hold it down. Don't think you can hear him coming. And that sounds really awful how I said it. Advance. Okay. Was that it? Nope. Oh, that's the ambience noise. Think it's gone. I don't know if I need to flush or not. Don't think I heard anything. Hello. No. Okay. Next one. Now it's the doors. No, you don't hear a thing, so I need to keep on checking either way. Okay, I think I can have some kind of tactic here. Just search, look, and then continue with the next one. complete sure so prototype does not have any sound here i just need to continue checking into his there that is fine at least there was only two animatronics then five, five children missing freddy fazbear's pizza mystery he got away 
good. Now let's try with the rest of them. That was quite simple for a 10 on 15. Unless like when it goes to 20 it like goes double about 40 something like that. Could be it. But this is a little bit more complicated so the two animatronics that we knew they're gone. Now we got all the rest. We got Timothy. Sure. A Timothy will come down the right hallway. Get rid of him by using your hyper flush. Okay, so hyper flush for Timothy. I think this was the one in the bedroom when you need to open up that vent. So it's kind of the same way as prototype, just with a hyper flush. So I don't have to hold on him, I just need to flush him. So that possibly means that I'll have a flashlight or something. Roger. Roger will appear in the right hallway. Winding up the desk toy will stop him. So does that mean that once a character is there, I need to wind it up? Or does it mean that I need to wind it up after a bit? I can assume the first theory, because he will appear in the right hallway, that makes more sense. Jeffrey. Jeffrey will appear on one of the four cam mini cameras on the first television. Click on the mini cam to cover this site. So similar to the last night with the paper, just this time I need to deactivate the camera and do something with it. Oh, and there was a piece of paper or something on that camera as well. So I'm guessing that will be it. Barry. Barry will appear on the second television, leaning into the doorway. Click shock to scare him. So he will appear, so he's not always there. And then the last one, Lewis. Lewis will appear on, on one of the first three televisions. When you see him, refresh the screen you see him on. So kind of like security threadbare. Yeah, because I was wondering what that refresh symbol was on the televisions. Now I know. Ready, let's go. So this one, I just need to take shake the right and then the four cameras to see if he's there. So should be quite simple. I don't have to check this third one as well. Unless obviously the security thing is there. Now, I don't know if there will be a sound cue again. So check this, go there. Oh, that's the wrong one. Control, and okay. Hello, I see ya. So do that. Uh, is he leaning in? Yeah, he was. Refresh. Okay, now it's a little bit more complicated. I did not shock him in time, I think. Because I did see him on the doorway. You can hardly see it though, but it should be fine. There he is. Shock. Okay, there we go. Uh, press on that. Press it. It's kind of difficult when the camera is moving. I cannot use... Oh, that was winding. Should be gone. Yep, it's gone. Good. Okay. Uh, the first animatronic is not there. One that you have to use a hyper flush. There he is. Stop it. Did he just deactivate that? Okay, he didn't. Doesn't seem to be anything else. Hello. Okay. You hear him. I think he's gone. I don't need to take it for that long. Yeah. At least I think. Shock. Okay, I get it. So only the right side of the door you can hear things. But apparently the prototype you cannot hear a thing. That, that is just there that randomly appears. So if I hear a noise, I can check the right door. If I do not, I can just continue checking the left door. That is a tactic for that, I guess. Because both of the animatronics will wind up one and then the hyper flush. They work with the same sound cue. So the ones on the top row are the ones that I need to actively search for. 
and then for ones at the bottom with other ones that just appear and need to do something about it. Now we got this one, a bit of everything and then the last one will be the ultimate revenge. I don't know how difficult that will be, I guess we need to find out. So for this one, what is the tactic? Check the left door, uh, check on, uh, who, who was it, I think it was the suit. If I hear noise, check the right door and then the rest of them is self-explanatory, I just need to look out for them. Should be fine. Hopefully it won't be that difficult. Okay. Don't think I heard anything. Yeah, I didn't. Okay, uh, refresh, it's so difficult to, t to turn it off once your camera is moving, and I forgot about the prototype. Okay, I was kind of confused because I clicked off a screen or something, I did not hear the audio, so I don't know if he actually moved or something. Actually, I'm just gonna turn these ones all to 20, just to hear those sound effects once again, so then I will have a better chance of knowing what is going on. Okay, I heard it then. I did not hear a thing there. I also hide up my volume. Yeah, it's really low down volume. You have to turn the headphones all the way up. That's kind of annoying. Also, what is this? Mine is a puppet. Don't think it was there before. I do not know what just killed me. I think it was this? Yeah, it was this. That's what I have to do. So every time that I, I um, click on the right side of the screen, sometimes it goes off the volume. Yeah, sometimes it happens. I, yeah, it's kind of annoying. I keep clicking off screen. And I forgot about this guy as well. Oh, I'm starting to pull in my webcam now. Yeah, I'm gonna die. There uh, doesn't seem to be anything here. Get off. I couldn't see that yet. That's annoying. Oh, hello.
Okay, wasn't that difficult. I'm gonna give this a few tries. I was... How did I die from prototype? I am extremely confused. Oh well, let's try again. Okay, I got him that time. For some reason... I just need to prioritize the ones that kill me first. Problem is, I don't know which one do that. Okay. So the thread, the Freddy thing is there. You can click on there. And I was about to click on Freddy. Jeffrey, not Freddy. So the one that makes noise is Roger. That's the one that makes noise, not Timothy. Timothy just appears there. I see ya. Get off! That's so annoying. I'm clicking on the thing but it won't turn off. That's taken a long time. Freddy, get out! Get off! Okay, it wasn't difficult at all. <laughs> the problem is, I keep on clicking off the screen, so it's annoying, but... Hey, did it. Oh, what's this? 
switch off the power. Sure. Um, can I? I mean, I'm trying to. It doesn't seem to be working. Also, my throat is going for some reason. Switch off the power. I am trying to. I'm clicking everything. It was the enter key. Okay. Well, let's go down. Enter the soup. Nah. I'm gonna go to the right. Well, I have to. Let's go in the soup. Find the intruder. Why, why would there be an intruder? I'm going downstairs. Is this like a basement? Oh, take him away. Oh, is he dead? Uh, enter. Grab him by his head. Sure. If he's dead. No one will believe him. The gateway ending. So yeah, in the end it wasn't that difficult at all. We just need to pay attention to where they were and we're done. 720 mode done. It's no second star, but near's this. I don't know what that is about. But yeah, that has been Fredbear and Friends Left to Rot, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye everyone.